Hello there. I just want to do a quick review of this Winnowell fiberglass paddle. I really like this. I've been using it for a while now and it's become my go-to paddle. You can see it's a bit mucky because I was pushing out of some mud the other day. So you can see this is the, uh, the 250 centimeter one. I went for a 250 predominantly because in the Ride Before 20 kayak that I have, I found the kayak a bit wide and I wondered if a longer paddle would splash less water in the boat. It didn't really make any difference. That kayak, particular kayak is more suited to tandem kayaking. If you check out my videos, you'll see what I mean. Let's just have a quick look at the spec on this. So as you can see, it's the winner well. The shaft is made of fiberglass. It's got an oval hand index, right and left. You can hardly see this, but it's slightly oval where your hands go. But it does feel very comfortable in your hand. The blade material is fiberglass and reinforced nylon. So this is quite tough. The blade length and width. So it's about 18 to 19 inches from top to bottom and about eight inches across and the feather angle is 60 0 60. I'll show you what that means in a second and the weight is about 2.84 pounds just over a kilo in weight. I've got the orange one there is a blue paddle available and I am going to buy a blue one a slightly shorter one. I've previously only had paddles that have come with the boat and I did buy a Conway aluminium paddle but I have to say this one's been my favorite so far. It does have drip rings on it on both sides and it slots together nicely. So when it talked about the feather angle, that's here, 60, 0, 60. And that means if you've got this little notch here in there, it means the paddles are both flat facing the same direction. And then you can angle them by using the other holes, by slotting it into the other holes. So let's just drop this in. So that just slots into there. You'll know what I mean. Experienced paddles will know what I mean. When you shake it, if they rattle about a bit, they just feel horrible when you're using them. But yeah, it feels really good in your hand. And I think with it being fiberglass, it feels warmer too. Yeah, gotta admit, I do, I really love this paddle. Really glad I bought it. Can't remember how much I paid for it. I'll put a link to it in the description below. So if you want one, you can grab one. I hope you like this quick review. If you do, please give the video a thumbs up. If you don't, give it a thumbs down, it's up to you. If you like what I'm doing on this channel, by all means subscribe. It costs you nothing, it just means that YouTube will give you a notification when you open it up to say that I've uploaded a new video. That's all for now, see you soon.